Hi, it's Peter here from Invent the Summer. This week your challenge is to build a boat that moves on its own. You can build any kind of boat you want, but it must be able to move through the water on its own. It can't just float. Here's some rules. You can use any materials you want to build your boat. You can propel your boat in any way that you want to. You can use any body of water that works for you. A bathtub, sink, lake, pond, or a puddle are great options. You can't assist the boat with your hand or any other part of your body, or make waves to make it move. You can't use a pre-made, store-bought, or toy boat. Please don't use electricity near water, so don't use fans or hair dryers to make wind. Seriously, you could electrocute yourself and die. Once you figure out how to make your boat move, see how far or how fast you can get it to go. You could even build two boats and have a race. And now a few tips to avoid making your parents mad. Be sure to ask before you use materials that you plan to get wet. For the record, a computer is not a good base for a boat and a phone is not a good sail. Try to avoid spilling water all over the place. When you do spill water, be sure to clean it up right away. Don't build your boat in the middle of the kitchen while your parents are cooking. Don't create a body of water where it shouldn't be. And definitely don't use a toilet as your body of water. Submit your videos to our website by Sunday at 9 p.m. Then be sure to come back on Monday and Tuesday to see everyone's solutions and vote for your favorites. Don't forget, everyone who enters the challenge this week will earn one ticket to our big end of summer prize drawing. You will earn a bonus ticket whenever someone enters their first Invent the Summer challenge and gives you credit for telling them about us. Have fun boating! Invent, 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 invent the summer.org. Yeah!